Look at this guy's pay stub through March 10th, 2023. So just over two months, two months and 10 days. His gross wages year to date are 4.18 million. Net wages, 2 million. So he's paying about half of his salary just to taxes. Our government appreciates that. Our budget needs that. Thank you, sir. $4.1 million in the first two months of the year. We see studies over and over again on how professional athletes can make this kind of change and in five years be broke. I've read so many articles about this, whether it's athletes or lottery winners. They make so much money, but what do they have to show for it when it's all done, when their knees are blown out, when, when their bones just hurt too much to play anymore, or when your lottery winnings run out? What do they have to show? They need to be looking for hidden money, man. I love it when we get clients like this that just start getting a major payday and they're like, hey, I know this is great money. I've been working my whole life towards this. Now, what can I do to capitalize off of this moment in this earning period? And we can help them with a financial advisor. And we start doing estate planning and asset protection planning. So many people don't. They take this money and then I get it. A lot of their lives, they've been broke like us most of our lives. You start making some coin, you want that nice car, you want that big house, you want that swimming pool like we put in our backyard. But if you don't plan appropriately, if you don't seek out the hidden money in, in all the different avenues that are available to you in your life, that $4.1 million can dry up, sadly, really quickly. Yeah, Mike, like you said, this is Eric Armstead, and he plays for the 49ers football club, so... Why that's important, we already did a little short video of how state taxes hurt these athletes. And as you can see here, the great state of California takes their fair share of $41,000 from Arik's hard work. $430,000 year to date. 430000 yep. in two months and 10 days. Go, California, right. go. Yeah, they got their structure set up right. And so that is where a lot of tax planning needs to be done too. Now, obviously, for this pay period, it was a home he was probably working out it the nfl season wasn't in it was february to march so this was his workouts this is just his base salary he got a signing bonus and all that good so once he starts traveling to the other states other states as you can see colorado illinois already took a small cut but when he starts traveling to these other states those states are going to take bigger cuts unless he plays the cowboys and then you can come play for a lot more tax advantage free because we don't have state tax in texas but some interesting things i saw on this was he maxed out his 401k 22500 maxed it out right off the bat. Now mm. that will go a long way, and that seems like a small amount of money in comparison to the big pot he's earning. But if you think about it, Arik, I don't know how old he is. He, I'm guessing he's probably 25, 27, probably 25 to 30 is my biggest guess. If he starts at maxing his 401k at that age, by the time he's 50, 60, he's going to have millions of dollars just from his retirement account. That's going to be shielded that he can't access. So he can't burn that unless he wants to get hit with penalties. But also what I thought was funny is that he got paid for a 40-hour time period. I'm sure these NFL athletes are putting in 80 to 100 easy with workouts, travel, and everything like that. And I just thought that was funny.